Hello everyone, welcome to Sonography Arena. Today I'll be presenting to you a case of paraiotic lymph adenopathy. Paraiotic lymph nodes are part of the retroperitoneal lymph node. This is a group of lymph nodes located anterior to the lumbar vertebra along the right and left side of the abdominal iota. Its main function is to, is to drain the abdominal organs and the GITs. Normal paraiotic lymph nodes are not readily visualized in ultrasound due to its small size, the lack of contrast between it and the surrounding tissue, and the intestinal gas. These lymph nodes can sometimes get infected by disease, either from the primary source of such infection or lymphoma, or secondary source in the case of metastasis. This gives rise to a condition known as lymph adenopathy. Having given you a little background, Let's quickly dive into our case for today. A 64-year-old male patient present with a recurrent abdominal pain that radiates to the back. Here are the images we got from ultrasound scan. As you can see from the image, clusters of predominantly hyperchoic masses are noted on each side of the abdominal aorta. These masses are not infiltrating. The posterior abdominal wall muscles are intact. This masses shows no vascularity on color doppler assessment. And that is the abdominal aorta located right there at the middle of the masses. And here is another image of the masses surrounding the abdominal aorta, And here is the real-time image of the masses and the abdominal aorta. And that is the abdominal aorta right there being compressed by the masses, especially at the distal aspect. And that is the gas from the intestine through some uh, dirty acoustic shadow on the masses. Once again, here are the images of the cluster of paraiotic masses. In conclusion, Multiple predominant hypochoic masses that appear stuck together are seen along the right and left side of abdominal aorta, suggesting paralytic lymphadenopathy. Thanks for watching.